Hello YouTubers. This video is a small demo on how to create and use dynamic text list. Let's get started. What is text list? Short answer would be, text list is a list of text lines. It is used to show texts, that are assigned to the values of the tag. Text lists can be static, or dynamic. I have covered some basics of static text lists in my previous video, link to it can be found in the description. I am going to create application example on the monitor of the status of the motor. First of all, create 4 tags of integer type. Those will be indexes for symbolic IO fields. Then, create 3 text lists. One for the names of the motor, second is for mode, and third one, is state. Create fourth text list with the name of motor. This list will be dynamic text list. It's going to show the index of the corresponding text list, and the text of the corresponding text list. For that, three value fields are needed. Zero is going to show the index and the value of the name's text list. To achieve that, select value zero. In the text field, click right button of the mouse, and select insert parameter field. Select process tag, index name, and click on confirm. Type colon and hit space. Click right button of the mouse again, and select, insert text list field. Select text list called, name, and tag, index name. First entry is done. It should look like that. Now, get to the value 1. Hit right button of the mouse, select, insert parameter field. This time process tag must be index mode. Type the colon and hit the space. Click right button of the mouse again, and select, insert text list field. This time, select text list called, mode and tag, index mode. Second entry is done. It should look like that. Let's go to the last entry. Repeat all the steps again. First, insert parameter list, and select tag name, index state. Type in colon, and hit space. Insert text list field. Select text list, called state, and tag, index state. Last entry is done. It should look like that. Switch back to the screen. Put four symbolic I.O. fields on the screen. Select one of them, assign text list with the name status, it will contain the status of the motor. And tag, index state. Select second one, and assign text list with name, mode, it will contain the mode of the motor. And tag, index mode. Select third one and assign text list named, name, it will contain the name of the motor. And tag, index name. Select fourth one, and assign text list, named, motor, that will be our dynamic text list. And tag, index motor. All is done. Let's try our application.
As you can see, values in the dynamic text list changes according to our static lists. Let's take a look at the relations table. As you can see, first text list is assigned to the first entry of the dynamic text list. Second one is to second, and third one is assigned to the third. That how it works. You can even make more advanced application. Thank you for watching, and happy coding!